What's good, beautiful people? It's your girl. I'm still Asia, baby. Cause every time I close my eyes, I see you. Welcome back to my channel, ladies and gentlemen. If you are new here, hello, hello, and welcome, okay? Be sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos from your girl, okay? As y'all can see from the thumbnail, I'm getting into someone new today. So I have to give a shout out, all right? I do owe this to somebody. And that is Rick Fortier, okay? I think I said that right, Fortier, F-O-R-T-I-E-R, -E okay? Shout out to you, Rick. He sent this to me. Actually, did you? No, he actually dropped the comment. I had to look and see because I'm like, did you send it? Sometimes people actually send me emails, y'all. So I had to check, but he actually sent this and he was like, hey, can you just check this out around the world in 80 buffets? Okay, I think around the world in 80 buffets. That's what it's called. And this is, uh, oh my gosh, this is John Pinette, Pinier. I hate when I see names, y'all, and I'm just like, I know it's probably about 10 different ways to say this name. <laughs> His name is John Pinet, I think. Pinetti? Pinetti. Pinetti. Pinet. Okay. okay. John. Okay, we're gonna go with John. <laughs> but this is a recommendation. So shout out to you, Mr. Fortier. Rick, thank you so much for sending this as a recommendation, y'all. If you didn't know, okay, if you're dropping recommendations down in the comment section, I see it. I will shout you out in the next video. So I gotta show mad love to Rick for putting me on. I don't think I've ever heard of this gentleman before. So this will be the first time I've seen him. So I'm excited to jump into it, y'all. Um and yeah, so I don't know what to expect, but you know, hey, you know, it is what it is. So I ain't finna make this video long, y'all. This video is long enough. So go on and get your popcorn ready. And let's go on and get into this video, y'all. Um, okay. All right, y'all, let me scoot over. Let me scoot over. All right, and let's jump into it. <laughs> It's a pleasure to be here, because I was just in Las Vegas, so I need the money. I lost a lot of money. I really did. <laughs> I mean, I got up. back at the buffet, don't get me wrong. <laughs> right? Hey. $9.95, all you can eat. We'll see who wins this friggin' hand out. <laughs> I can okay. believe I have blackjack. <laughs> I was at the prime rib counter going, hit me again. The buffet manager was horrified. You should have seen him. He looked like a deer caught in the headlights. <laughs> Not that look. Yeah, I be taking trade. <laughs> when we go to eat at like little CC's or CC's Pizza, my bad. When we go to CC's Pizza, y'all, Trey be eating up all the dang on pizza, okay? I know they be so glad when we leave because I be like, boy, you finna eat these people out of a business, okay? Can you sit down? <laughs> This little butt be eating, y'all. 12 years old, eat like a 35-year-old man. I swear he do. <laughs> Get the primer back in the kitchen. Finally, just, they just gave me my money back. Here's your thousand. Get out! <laughs> Actually, they have a buffet in Las Vegas. It's called the Oz Buffet. It's the Wizard of Oz theme, and it's a buffet. You walk up and it's the Emerald City and it's an all-you-can-eat buffet. I ran to it. Yeah, how did the witcher, how did the doctor, how did the night? Uh-uh. 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 Fine uh -uh. uh -uh. ribs and pork chops and scampi. Oh, my. Fine ribs and pork chops and scampi. Oh, my. <laughs> so. You know, I talk about buffets not because I'm a big guy. No, I'm actually writing a book, Around the World in 80 Buffets. <laughs> and in my research, I found that there are some foods that shouldn't be all you can eat. Like Chinese food shouldn't be all you can eat because you get hungry again. I don't know what it is. They put something in it. They must. Because I order takeout, they're always real happy. 
Oh, he's gonna be back. <laughs> I give that big boy one hour. Yeah. <laughs> he right on though, y'all. I promise y'all, it seems like that food just run right through me. Every time you eat Chinese food, you be hungry in like an hour, okay? <laughs> he is right on. Because you do get hungry again. What is it, too? And you go from full to starving. There's nothing in between. You go from, oh my God, I can't believe I ate all that chow mein. Hey, look, they brought egg rolls. <laughs> bring those, bring those in. <laughs> so I went to this Chinese all-you-can-eat buffet, and while the owner, he got pissed. I mean, he was rude, though. He'd come out every hour. Son of a bitch still here. <laughs> Eat up our food. <laughs> Look, he go again. He started screaming at me. You're going now. You're here for hour. Why you here for hour? You not come here anymore. <laughs> No, Why man. Why do you have spare rib? You're so big! <laughs> Eat vegetable! <laughs> Eat broccoli! <laughs> you scare my wife! <laughs> <laughs> no, man. Love Chinese food shouldn't be all you can eat. Now, Japanese food. For the book, I went to an all-you-can-eat sushi place. Mmm. <laughs> All the raw stuff I can eat, huh? It was $22.95. $22.95 for raw fish. $22.95, you throw this on the grill. <laughs> $22.95, I can't eat a dollar's worth. I brought a seal. <laughs> I put a no, lid on the table. Another plate, please. <laughs> <laughs> that seal ate buckets full. <laughs> the owner thought I was eating it all, though. Got yelled at again. <laughs> this guy scared me, though. He, he reminded me of Lord Toronaga from Shogun. <laughs> you? Big boy, come here! <laughs> you eat like free! That's you eat like free willy. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I was like, I don't know what he said. <laughs> Actually, I want to visit Japan. You know, sumo wrestlers in Japan are icons. Oh, I don't think I could be a sumo. No, no, they're big. <laughs> no, they really, I mean, those guys are big. I look at them and go, oh, you've let yourself go. No, man. <laughs> no. You know what I also tried for the book? Tried Indian food. Have you been out for Indian food? Yeah, bring a sandwich. <laughs> you know they're starving in India. <laughs> now I know why. <laughs> they got plenty of food, they just don't know how to cook it. <laughs> you see, Indian food's too spicy. It's, it is spicy. Spicy's a relative term, I know that. Spicy can mean a lot of things. Spicy could mean, oh geez, you know, that burnt my tongue a little bit. Or it could mean, ah! <laughs> Would you like some water? Thanks, I always scream at the table. Ah! It's too hot! I had that curry chicken, it went through my colon like a Japanese bullet train. <laughs> ah, no. I 
wasn't at the table five minutes. Where's the bathroom? <laughs> Way over there, huh? <sighs> Please, God, let me make it. <laughs> Don't let me take a dump in the lobby. Oh, look at the line. They served all the curry at once. They shouldn't do that. They oh, should no. You could hear Indian music coming from the bathroom. <laughs> no, man. <laughs> Bonsoir, mes amis. <laughs> and he's like, yo, if I was seven inches tall. <laughs> yeah. No. Ah. Oh, yeah. I don't know how many times I don't been to go eat somewhere. I don't know. I guess I wouldn't say like foreign, foreign food so much. Anybody, everybody's had that whole run in though. I feel like you don't went somewhere before you don't <laughs> sat out and ate the food before you even want to leave the table. <laughs> you gotta go to the bathroom, y'all. <laughs> And it'd be one of the bathrooms that be this big, okay? Small as I don't know what, okay? It's 10 people in the bathroom already. Everybody gonna see you come out type thing. <laughs> Six Flags, don't let it be the amusement park. Oh, them be the worst, y'all. Them be the worst, okay? Y'all, you know, he was cool though. I don't know. I've not heard of him before. I don't know it, where I might have seen him. I've, I've not seen him anywhere, but I don't know. Y'all, y'all tell me because I'm not like really hip to the whole comedian world in terms of comedians that are out there that are like kind of underground, the ones that are up and coming, the big ones, you know, because Rafi May was another one. I feel like Rafi May is probably, he's actually pretty, pretty big and I, I had forgot about Rafi May, but you know what I mean? So y'all let me know. What y'all thought about him? If y'all got some more recommend uh, recommendations for him, drop them down in the comment section. Let me know what y'all thought, okay? If y'all need some more of him, let me know, okay? I'll be sure to jump back into it. But shout out to my guy, Rick Fortier, for dropping a recommendation as well. So, if y'all enjoyed this video, be sure you give me a big thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos from your girl. And if ain't nobody told you, I love you. And I'm going to see y'all in the next video, y'all. Uh, bye, y'all.